Hi, history fans. Welcome to the Guys AI channel. Today, with the help of Stable Diffusion, we're traveling to the Byzantine Empire. We'll see people and their clothes from that time. It seems like it was during the time of the Christians. Remember, all of this is made by AI, so there might be some mistakes. I apologize for that. Now let's get started and see the Byzantine Empire in a new way. Take a look at this image. It features a blonde gentleman dressed in what appears to be traditional Byzantine attire. You know, there's something about these clothes that reminds me of ancient Greek fashion. There seems to be a hint of that classic Greek style peeking through. It's really quite fascinating how these cultures overlap and influence each other, isn't it? What are your thoughts on this? Do you see the similarities I'm seeing? It's intriguing how our stable diffusion tends to include many cross symbols when creating images related to Byzantium. Notice this gentleman here? He also has a cross around his neck. I guess it's the AI's way of capturing the deep religious sentiments associated with this era. What are your thoughts on this consistent theme? For those who may not know, the Byzantine Empire was a powerful civilization that existed from 330 to 1453 AD. Known for its rich culture and beautiful art, it evolved from the Eastern Roman Empire. Its capital was Constantinople, now Istanbul in Turkey. Let's turn our attention to knights. This picture and the next couple showcase knights in their classic armor. You'll see lots of armor indeed, but there's nothing too unusual to note here. I enjoy pictures like this one. It really lets you see the details of the clothing. There's a bit of armor, some golden touches, and a unique style, don't you think? At first, I wondered if there were many blonde people in the Byzantine Empire. But after digging into the history, I learned that it was a mix of different cultures and styles. So you'd find diverse looks, fashion, and attitudes there. These next few images intrigued me. I wondered, did men really wear such golden clothing back then? What's your take on this? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments. I'm quite fond of this image. Notice the ancient cityscape in the background? The architecture is castle-like, hinting at a blend of different cultures and time periods. Starting from this picture and for the next two, I aim to use facial animation to give a sense of how these people might have appeared in real life. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this new style of our video. Please subscribe, comment, and like this video. If you want to support our channel, you can find a Patreon link. Thanks again. See you in the next video.